Hi, I'm Kevin Harwood, and this is Ask a Developer. Apple has applied several new design themes in iOS 7, which is requiring us to approach applications in a new way. The biggest of which is content is king, which means that content needs to pop out to the user and everything else needs to get out of the way. We're now having to ask tough questions going back and looking at applications and deciding if things within that view are really relevant and necessary or if they're just clutter and getting in the way. This is allowing us to create tons of new experiences in our application, and I'm really excited to see what other developers do when iOS 7 hits later this fall. iBeacon is a great new technology from Apple that's going to allow applications to become more location aware in the future. In the past, applications had to specifically rely on the GPS chip, as well as cell tower tri triangulation to understand where they were in the real world. But now, with iBeacons, we can leverage Bluetooth low energy to detect where exactly we are in relation to other things in the real world. For example, a retail store could put iBeacons all around their environment. And as a customer moves around that retail store, the application can get specific contextual information of where they are and present users with relevant content in the application going forward. I don't think there should be a separate version of iOS specifically for iPad. Apple already provides specific tools for both platforms within the SDK. So I think it's on the developer to understand the platform they're building for and leverage those tools to build a great experience for the user. I certainly don't think you should take an iPhone application and just scale it up to be an iPad application. You should work with a design team to properly create an experience for the platform that you're targeting. I expect adoption rates for iOS 7 to be very high very quickly. This specific update is unlike any other software update we've seen on any platform in the last 10 years. In the past, if you had a project that was in flight or maybe just starting and a new software update was announced, you really weren't that concerned about it because either it didn't offer enough new features to care about or the expected adoption rate was gonna be so slow that it wasn't going to impact your near-term plans. However, with iOS 7, it is a massive redesign of the OS and the adoption rate will be extremely fast. So if you're not already considering the impact of this on your application, you're already behind. That's it for this week's Ask a Developer. If you've got any more questions for us, hit us up on Twitter with hashtag AskADev.